Hello, you are the Match Rapid, and welcome to Game of Thrones. So, this is episode 4, part 19. Hope you enjoy me to like, comment, subscribe, and let's begin. So, here we are. We're back at home at last. Back at High Point, I wasn't sure your brother would survive the day. He nearly didn't. But you kept your head and took Lud's deal. And now Ryan will be coming home. He'll sleep in his bed. Eat at our table. He'll be right here, where he belongs. Restoring our family is just the beginning. Next we'll rebuild. Make ourselves strong again. <sighs> oh, Roderick. Sometimes you sound just like your father. My lord, look. Ah! <gasps> no one's here. Where are the gods? Duncan! Where are the Glenmores? Where's anybody? <laughs> I'm right here. <laughs> Come on. Don't be so dreary. It was a joke. I'm sorry, I... I should have laughed. Oh, maybe you think you can do better. Of course not. I... I didn't mean to... Perhaps a song instead. I hear you've written a touching song about your dead brother. Am I in it? Let's hear it, shall we? No. No? Roderick! Roderick! Welcome back. Get away from my sister. But we're having such a nice time. Aren't we, Talia? Say it. Say it's been lovely. It's been... lovely. And you. I'm told you're a man who can't be broken. I've decided to come see for myself. Next time on Game of Thrones. Ethan was the first forester I killed. Doesn't have to be the last. You don't know what you're in for, Garrod. What you're asking my brother to do. The North Grove isn't what you think it is. Justice was for Marine to deliver, not you. But we did as you commanded! These aren't sellswords, Asher. They're killers. Roderick! I can't believe I trusted him. I know you and my brother were in contact. Perhaps he told you things. Things that might prove his guilt. Perhaps you are not to be trusted either. Oh, you're not listening, Garrid. Shh. So guys, this is going to be episode 5. Hopefully enjoy it. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And let's begin episode 5. You'd help the second sons. Guide them into Marine. I can't, Asha. This could be our only chance. Get them into the city, help them liberate Marine, and I will see that you are rewarded. You think you can have reason with a wardling? No, oh, I'm, uh, I'm a friend. Don't move. This is my sister, Sylvie. I have to get in there, Sarah. Lord Whitehill is up to something. He's conspiring against my family, and someone in there is helping him. Andros is hiring sellswords. Hundreds of them. What? 
He's building an army for Lord Whitehill, big enough to march against Ironrath. Talia, I may be leaving you here with a traitor. Find out who it is. Rodri! I'm told you're a man who can't be broken. I've decided to come see for myself. I was just telling your sister. Father's been looking to make a match for me. And Talia's been such good company. Think she likes me? Or maybe your mother? Her flower plucked is still a flower. Just dies more quickly. We could be a family, Lord Forrester. You'd like that, wouldn't you? You killed our brother! I've killed many brothers. Sisters, too. But let's put our happy day to the side for a moment. Walk with me. Oh. You won't need your sword. Not where we're going. I'm not going without my sword. I'm afraid you are. Here. I'll help you. <sighs> there. Oh, doesn't that feel better? Oh, you're coming too. This is Lord's business, not a child's. I say she comes. I don't trust her with my men. How fares your father, Lord Bolton? Better than yours. <laughs> Polite of you to ask. I loved playing in the woods when I was your age. Still do. So many places to hide. I've gotten very good at finding people. Roderick? It's all right, Talia. That reminds me. Where's Griff? <laughs> I expected to be greeted by him on my arrival. Bit of a disappointment to have to show myself in. And here I had such high hopes for Ludson. Now should I know? Griff and his men are not my concern? My concerns are your concerns. I assume you forgot that when you took them prisoner. Oh, I really hoped things might be different with you. I hoped we could be friends. After all, I was generous. I've allowed you to keep half your forest. Your livelihood. Yet you went behind my back and called in the Glenmores. I'm not sure how you managed that. The Glenmores have sworn their loyalty to my father. Lady Elena Glenmore is our guest. The soldiers accompanied her to ensure her safety. If her safety is a concern, perhaps she should not have come to Ironrath. Well, I'm certainly glad we've sorted this out. Thank you for being so forthcoming. But there's still a price. Release me. Ah. I will leave here. Here we are. Arthur! Roderick! You disobeyed me. You disrespected me. Someone has to pay! You didn't think it would be you. Your damaged goods. Someone else's leftovers. No one has to pay! Let's just keep talking. I'm bored of talking. No! Stop! Look at what you've done! I hope it was worth it. Is it worth it, Arthur? Please stop! <laughs> please, please! Talia, don't look away. No! It's very important you see what comes of disobedience. Roderick, make him stop! Please, do 
something! You pay for this, Ramsey! <laughs> Look at him, Talia. <laughs> See what your brother's done. Please, please, Lord Ramsay. Sorry, but they'll never learn otherwise. <laughs> mercy, have mercy! Mercy, my lord! Did Roderick show mercy to Griff? This is his fault. That's a lot of blood. <laughs> I'll see you dead for this! And that, Talia, is why no one likes your brother. Ah, <sighs> the poor lad's fainted. Let's give him a minute. <laughs> you want to kill me, don't you? Release him. Go on. Prove how strong you are. Do it for Ethan. No, Roderick. He's toying with you. Do it. <laughs> I'm impressed. <laughs> Woo. Lucky for me, you're a cripple. I may have misjudged you, Roderick. I came here to kill you. But now, I'm thinking... It might be far more entertaining to watch you and Lud tear each other to pieces. I never want to come back to this fucking shit stain of a holdfast. I have better things to do than to play wet nurse to you and Lud. So you'll settle this on your own. Last house standing wins. Otherwise I'll kill you both and be done with it. You're insane. At least I'm not you. And one more thing. <laughs> Can't leave a job half finished. Oh, ready the horses. Not sure you'll have much luck finding other allies. All right, so um, here we are. Do 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 do. So welcome, guys. We're in episode five. It's been really long, but yeah, we're finally finished. We're halfway through. We're almost up to episode six, which is the end. I really enjoyed Game of Thrones Telltale Edition. It's very good. I think they should have done season two, which would be excellent. But yeah, I'm hoping the last part will be good. Um, sorry guys, that was a bit disturbing. But yeah, hopefully the, the other parts will be fine. And yeah, so. So yeah. But anyways, uh, hopefully you enjoy. Remember to like, comment and subscribe. And yeah, let's get to it. So yeah, this is, I, I don't get copyrighted, so the theme song is gone. And yeah, so, sorry I... um. Um, sorry I uh, censored some of the parts because it's too much, so yeah, but anyways, let's go and let's begin. Episode 5, A, ne a Nest of Vipers. This is so sad, but we're gonna get revenge. Don't worry, we're gonna get revenge, sir. Only a monster would do such a thing. The Boltons will pay for this. Okay. Arthur. Oh, I'm 
so sorry. Why, after all we've been through, must the gods continue to shit on this house? What have we ever done to them? Follow the Starks? Obey the rule of law? Ramsay Snow is a bloody savage. He shames the entire North. Yet we're bound by law to obey him. Can't believe it's fucking come to this! The Glenmore Guard are gone. Ordered home by Ramsay. So much for having allies. Ramsay says he's not taking sides anymore. He means to let the strongest house survive. I intend that to be yours, Royland. You'll get no argument from me. But how do we bloody fight them? We just don't have the numbers. Not yet, anyway. Right now, everything depends on Asher. Once he and Malcolm bring us more fighting men, then Where we... is he? Where is my brother? My lady. My lady. Let me through! Elena. Roderick, tell me where he... Oh, no. No. Oh, no. No, Arthur, no! Arthur! It's my fault. I brought him into this. I asked him to help. You can't blame yourself, Elena. He was a grown man. He made his own choices. But he trusted me. He always has. I was there the day he learned to hold a bow. He was so nervous that father called him Quiver. And now to die. Like this. Tortured. Ramsay Snow did this. He's a madman. Ramsay was here because of you, Roderick. If we hadn't been your allies. Elena. I'm sorry. Get you someplace, Wal. How do I do this, Roderick? How do I keep going? Where do I find the strength? You can't help the dead. So care for the living. For me, that's Ryan, Talia, Mira, and you. Roderick. You've been such a friend to me, Roderick. Right from the very beginning. I should try to get some sleep. I'm not sure I'll be able to. But... I don't know what else to do. I understand. Sleep well, Elena. You're our guest here. For as long as you need. Thank you, Roderick. That... That means a lot. Okay, set down our deeds. Right, I'm gonna stop this video here. Thank you so much for watching part 19 of episode 4. I'll be doing part 20 of episode 5 very soon. So remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video of Overmake.